We are winding down the first day of our Together We Can holiday food and fun drive. Our goal is to collect $250,000 by Saturday in order to feed nearly 10,000 hungry families. News Channel 10's Greg Kerr is out at Margaret Street United with How You Can Help. Well, thank you, Lindsay. It's been a terrific Monday, first day of the High Plains Food Bank Drive, and it's been, um, number one, a beautiful day out here. So we had some, had some great crowds at five and six, and tonight it's, it's gotten pretty chilly out here. So, But we're going to be back again tomorrow all the way through Friday right here in front of the uh, Market Street on Georgia. And so please come out, let us know, give us a donation. Always asking for canned goods, dry goods, or monetary donations as well. All right, let's get to this. Right now I've got uh, Garrett Payne with me. He's out of Happy State Bank. And Garrett, what your bank is doing, of course, is, is so important for the community. How do you guys get involved in this? Absolutely. We always uh, show up to this event every year. We've been given to this event for uh, many decades. And mm -hmm. so we just like to just continue to give back however we can. How important is it for the for the bank to kind of to really kind of feel a part of this as well? You know, we obviously talk about the employees being involved or customers or corporate or whomever. But how important is it for Happy State Bank? Absolutely. Well, Happy is a big part of the Texas culture here, especially in Amarillo. And so it's nice that we just get to give a chance for people to not go hungry in this area. OK, so you guys have done uh, twenty five hundred dollars raise and that will feed. 32,500. Absolutely. It goes a long way with High Plains Food Bank. 13 meals for every dollar. Yeah. They know how to stretch it. All right. Appreciate it. Thanks, Garrett. Appreciate what Happy Bank, uh, Happy State Bank is doing. And Wes Reeves with XL Energy is with us right now. And uh, same with you guys. Big corporation, but you guys know how to get into the community, and that's what you're doing here exactly. with the High, Plain, High Plains Food Bank. Garrett took all my talking points, but <laughs> no. Uh, you know, we're... we're uh, our, our area covers what the High Plate Food Bank covers, uh, the 26 counties and beyond. We're in every community in this region, and so we always say for our communities, to, in order for us to succeed, our communities need to succeed. Uh, and one thing we've noticed in, in all of our communities, if, we're, if, we're, if people are falling behind, that community can't succeed. And food insecurity is one of the greatest reasons people fall behind. So they miss out on all the other opportunities, education, health care. This is vitally important. And uh, as you said, you know, one dollar can can account for 13 meals. So it's so easy yeah. for us to get involved. You also have the beautiful snowman behind us too, <laughs> yeah, right? It's a snow bear. <laughs> it's a snow bear, yeah. Yeah, okay. I had nothing to do with that, but it, it one of our employees did, so yeah. for sure. But no, we're we're glad to be here. Uh, you know, as happy as we're here every year. Actually, we're always paired with happy at this event. It seems like that uh, there's always hamburgers and hot dogs, and we had a good time this evening. And uh, look forward to a whole nice week. And I think it's only getting warmer as we get into the rest of the week. For sure. All right, Wes. Thank you so much, Garrett. Thank you so much for all you guys do for the High Plains uh, Food Bank. Let's send it back to the studio. We'll be back in a few minutes.